this week on the Hoover Boys. I'm glad we came over here. We got a thin silver looking coin right there. We have not pulled old silver out of this field. We pulled so many coppers. Well, today we're back at our big farm, the place where Bob dug his huge gold ring two weeks ago. We dug some coppers. We're trying a different field today because this place is so big. We have a lot of fields we haven't touched yet. I'm just, I'm just doing an intro, Bob. <laughs> Sees me filming, he's all worried. Um, I don't film an intro until like we find something because I can't tell you how many intros I've filmed and then we've gone out and not found anything. So we found a few things today. Let's get you up to speed. All right, well, uh, we literally just turned our machines on. Bob dug a weedy. A weedy. And now he's saying big copper. That is exactly what I'm saying. I mean, the truck is literally right there. There's no mistake in what I'm saying. Oh, man. <laughs> I mean, I'm you want to touch it? You yeah, can touch I gotta it. I got to touch it. <laughs> Brad, you should... Yeah, you don't have any gloves on. Put your tongue <laughs> and clean it. Button. Button. <laughs> yeah. Not pretty. Yeah, this one might need a toothpick. It's cold out here this morning. The ground's a little frozen on here, top. Where are we going now? All right, let's figure it out. Oh, Hopefully, it's not uh, yeah, well smooth. Nice, dude. Thanks, bro. Here. Uh, it's pretty chunky, dude. I'm not seeing anything to identify it yet. Maybe once it dries out. Darn. <laughs> you are on the board already with a copper. 30 seconds in. Good job, Bobby. Thank you. Thank you Hopefully much. that's not the curse. Hopefully, Hopefully that's not. a good omen. Well, the weedy would have been the first signal, would have been the curse. Hey, what did Grace say to you? So, this we have skipped. What did Grace say to me? Are you going to take a copper? Yeah, she did. She did. Yeah. And I said, no, not yet. But I soon. Was correct. And now that's two. Well, if you want to count a weedy. A weedy's copper. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Thanks. Let's do it. Brad's got a nice live digger. Let me see what kind of numbers you got. I'd like I'd like to see some silver this early. Maybe the mid 80s. I was gonna I was gonna wait to see if you want to do a bet for silver, but I'm gonna wait for you after you dig this hole. <laughs> <laughs> If this isn't silver, you want to do 10 bucks for the first silver seated or older? I mean, yeah. Okay. If this isn't? I mean, no. Is that it? Probably. Yep, yeah, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, well, there's other stuff here, too, besides coins. I like it, though. There's a lot of signals. Touch me. Uh. <sighs> Alright, Bob's coin was not the 32nd curse. Because I got me a copper. Woo! One but an inch or two deep. You can see where I broke the cloud apart. Slunk. No doubt about that one. That was an 8081, so I'm thinking US. Oh, my foot's cramping up on me. Oh, it's chunky. It is chunky. Fertilizer coin. Yeah, it was yeah, heavy it fertilizer. Yeah, I think it's US. Let me Nature scrape it. Classic. Let me scrape it, see if I can get an ID. Yeah. Unfortunately, this coin got some fertilizer over the years. That's what they look like in the fertilized farm fields, all pitted and nasty. I do believe it's a matron head. That's the reverse, the reef. And then uh, Lady Liberty would be on this side. I can almost see her outline. It beeps like U.S. It most looks like U.S. It's a matron head. Just toasty. Good sign, though. Hopefully there's some old silvers in here. That'd be fun. We have been live digging some signals, but they've all been junk so far. Oh, poo? It's a cob. It's aluminium. Here. Boop. Where's the silver stuff? That is Ooh. not silver. Cop really? Copper pipe. All right. Uh. We'll try again. Be a coin. Is that it? Little one? No, junk. Ah. Yeah, see it now. It's right there. Yeah. What is it? Ew, I dug some of that. Ew. Um... Here's what I just found on the surface. Nice little flat button. Nothing nothing fancy about it, but it's a great sign of the older stuff here. There has been a few Wheaties dug. And there's two coppers. 
So we're gonna have some fun, try to save some more history and see what this field holds. Let's do it. The live digs have not been in our favor today, but we're gonna try one more time. This is a good signal, take a listen. Not very deep, but it is solid. It might be bigger than a coin, but it's just so solid. It's not deep. I probably should have gone went down with the probe. Just pop it. Give me a big silver. Whatever it is, it's right there. Helps me make the noise, yep. More poo. More live dog poo. Yep. Nothing special on it. Dang. Not even an ID tag. Bradley's on the board. Figure he's gonna be another shotgun shell. Yeah, we're digging a lot of shotguns. Indian? There's a wreath on there, or a head. There is. It's an episode. Yay. I don't know what kind of date you have, though. It's that one? Warped. Yeah. I don't think I'm a little beat up. It. No, he didn't hit it. It's a toasty, man. We need to find some silver to see what they look like out of this oh, field. Man. The copiers have been tough. I think it's 18s, but. Good lord, this is gross. Yeah, it's chunky. Well, good job, buddy. Thanks, man. See, I knock it out of your hand. All the trash signals we've live dug today, I'm calling this one a coin. This one has to be a coin. So tight. Oh, that might even be silver. Houghton copper. Just be a coin. Oh, clad quarter. Clad quarter. No, Give him the D. Cow tag. Like that. <laughs> is, this a is that it? Hand? This? Oh, is that it? No. Oh, maybe it's on the other side of that. Yeah, that's it. No? It's going to be on that clod, I think. Oh, no. Did I miss it? No, you're fine. I thought I had it pinpointed there. Well, you, you're using the thunder for the first time. It's a long coil. Copper. Beautiful. Ah, oh, that is beautiful. Good job on the call, man. Uh, I knew it was just it was just too tight. Too perfect of a signal. Look at this little guy. That's US. Yep, that's US. Maybe a braided? One cent. Oh, that's not bad. I think it's a matron. Is it a braided or a matron? Braided or matron? Okay. That one's oh. much better looking than our copper. See me the yep. finger finger? Yep, yep, yep. And oh, good. So quiet over here. Though. It's a braided hair. Yeah, it's been really quiet when we got away from the, the truck. Braided hair, large scent. Yeah, that's a nice reverse. So it's probably sitting face up. Got all the acid rain and all the particles. You're gonna, you're gonna. I'll kiss Liberty. <laughs> your chap sticking up to kiss Liberty. I like your it. Chapstick. <laughs> Good job. So we all have a copper. Oh, time for me. Good job. We're all on the board. Thanks a lot. Nice work. We had lunch. It's been about an hour. We've been hitting this hill, finding nothing but junk. Nothing, period. Bob's got a little something. Brush it off? No, I didn't mess with it. Are you, you got a good signal over there? I'm sorry. I'm trying to block the wind. It's like a little castle or something. Looks like it was a cuff wing. It's not silver. It's like silver plated. Do you have a good signal that you're going to dig or no? Here. No, I don't. That's pretty cool. I like that. I don't think so. Good or bad? Silver. No. No. Alright, well, time to move on. Well, after uh, digging that, I think we're going to move on. Look at the shank on this. Side. We're going to go to the front field way up there. You ever found a shotgun base all shanked up? Nice found shank on that shotgun shell. shell. We probably dug a hundred shotgun shells. No lie. A truck over there. Yeah, we're gonna go try our front field where we have had success in the past. Pull tab. That is not a pull tab. Uh, I'm pretty sure it is. It was beeping 76 out of the hole. I'm hoping it's a pull tab. It sounds like silver to me. 
I'm glad we came over here. We got a thin silver looking coin right there. We have not pulled old silver out of this field. We pulled so many coppers. Oh my. Okay, it's one real. I thought it was, I thought it was US at first. It's hold right there. Brad owes me 10 bucks. <laughs> Did you bring your paycheck? <laughs> One real. Oh, you gonna give me some food, buddy? Wow, I can't believe I hit that signal. You give me the silent treatment? Oh no, I'm showing the house. There's the 1700s house back in there. I need some food. I told you the bet was off after lunch. You did not tell me the bet was off. It's a one real. It's hold. I, I, I can't see any details because Bob won't give me oh, any food. Hold? Yeah, it's hold. You've never found a hold coin, have you? Right in the middle of this field where we beat the hell. It's hold? Yeah, it, it wasn't deep. I mean, it, it came out right there. I hit it on top of all this stuff. I kicked it. <laughs> That's the old stuff. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Hit me, B. Whew. <laughs> what, a, what a lifesaver. First piece of old silver out here. We've pulled some barbers, but. Okay, B. That's good for now. Let's see what kind of details we have. Alright. It's nice. It's not bad. 1780. 87. King Charles III. Finished cleaning it. Do a nice close up. It said 1787 British. <laughs> oh man. Well, it, now it's officially a Hoover Boys episode. We have Spanish silver. I think we've moved on from the Indians. 1787. King Charles III. Beautiful hole in that coin. It's a Mexico City mint. To one real. Yeah, we've pulled so many coins out of here, but this is the first early piece of silver. Whew. That's awesome. It's my second one real in the year. We've got a bunch of halves. There's got to be more here. I'm kissing King Charles. Sorry, Liberty. Oh, it's been a rough day. I mean, we got those three coppers right off the, the bat, but. Nice silver smile. We got a little bit of time left, but the sun's going down quick. I hate this time of year. Leo. We just had our club meeting. We're doing a little wrap up after the club meeting. We've had a couple more buttons, but uh, nothing too exciting. So let's go over what we did find today. There's the board, but first, all those signals we had to wade through to find the good stuff. Bob, you got you got the, you got the D. I got the D. Rain's guide. Not sure that on that one. Cool fancy hole slot thing. You got silver today? I did. That's from the meeting. It was not a dig. Uh, uh, he's got a flip. turn of the century piece of pottery, Bennett, Baltimore. That's pretty cool. Uh, how many wheats? Four, Four wheats. wheats. We got a couple buttons. All I needed was a wheat. That was right back to the easy way. That's a cool little something. Silver plated. We're guessing maybe a cufflink. You got a musket ball. Some, some sort of funky buckle. You think that's buckle? And I do believe this is a matron head. Actually, that's the way it sits right just like that. Yeah. Now it's a matron. I can see it now. It's got the stars up front. It's facing left. Whew, that's a that's a that's a tough tough coin. No, look just like that. You can you can see the top of her bust. Bradley, yeah, you got a. You got a braided hair, large scent. Coppers are coming out toasted. He did end up with a V nickel. Is that 12? The 12. 1912, and you got the Indian on the day. Two little tiny buttons. Here's my stuff. Little bottle. I got the D. Got a non precious ring. It's got a couple hearts on it. Uh, I got those buttons there. One nice Tom back. Waterfail. 1988. Bird ring. A uh, ruler piece, some lead, a thimble. This is not a nightingale. This is some sort of heart thing. That was pretty deep. Yeah. We got a weedy, a matron that's toasted, 
And I had the uh, lucky swing of the day. Mm. Maybe it was the blue hat, who knows. 1787, one real hold, Mexico City Mint. Good looking coin. The only early piece of silver that we found at that property. Ever. Ever. Besides this. Pretty sure that you pre your, your, uh, your, <laughs> your silver plate job. That's solid. It's not solid. Until next week, help clean up the ground. Dig it all and take your trash with you. Why, Leo? Because all holes matter. That is correct. Wow. I'm not going to ask Brad anymore because he likes to mess that part up. <laughs> <laughs>